Hey, hello guys, this is here. I hope you're all feeling well. Today we are playing Riot of Willy, where we have to escape a mad scientist who wants to make some dirty experiments on us, turning us into a monster. So yes, let's go. Secret record. Experiment. A few months ago, his brother went to the Howdar forest for an experiment. As it turns out, in this forest, there is an abandoned house. An abandoned house? Laboratory where creepy experiments on people Whoop. are carried out. All these experiments are done by a mad doctor named Willie. At least he used to be a doctor. After one of the substances he tried on himself turned into a monster. Many people have been in his house. Some of them failed. He turned himself turned into, into a cartoon character. Monsters that are waiting for new souls to devour them. Everything Michael seems to be realistic, place. sorta. Now he has to explore but the him. territory and find a way out. He to literally <laughs> Willy nearly turned himself into a cartoon character <laughs> in our real world. <laughs> inventory. Oh my goodness. We have inventory too. Ooh. Little mouse. Little mouse. Look at the details. Hi, if you found this walkie-talkie, then I'm already at the transformation stage. I found it. You're very unlucky to be here, but you have to get out alive. Nah. This house, it's... Uh, oh, oh shit. look at that! The to monster number nine. I don't consider myself unlucky to get here. Like this is the exact place I want it to be. Do you wanna just chit chat? Can I open the door? You have a nice hat. Um, outside it's raining. It's like a pretty good choice. If you're asking me, why? Like why? Can't I have a solid moment here? Just me alone and my intimacy? Monster number nine really wanna get into my house. You know what? I wanna help this poor fella. I wanna open the door for him. He doesn't w really wanna hurt you, he just wanna scare you. He's banging on the half broken door. Like it's already broke in. This might be just a form of knocking for his pieces. So, let's get to work here, guys. Uh, one, two, three, four, nani nani ni. What if I try that? One, four, boom. No, the code is a bit more intricate than that. Teeny tone, I hear you. I hear you too, you loud as fuck, dude. Bang him on my door. Whoa! What the hell? Oh no! <laughs> I can run out of time. No! <laughs> That's the worst thing that possibly can happen. Me and a game, and it's time bound. It's the worst. Ah! Quick thinking. Tuk 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 tuk. I repair the door. Nobody can come through the door. Shush! Ho ho! Ho ho, I did something! Ah, uh, did something unusual. I boarded the door. So, can I have like a key, do you think? My next plan, try to hit everything with my excellent hammer. Oh! A cross! I wanna see the reaction of this dude if I show the cross to him. Hello? Did it bring you the chill? There's monsters in this house. They're gonna try to grab you. I'm hiding in the closet. <laughs> oh, no, 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 it wasn't it wasn't the deal. Can I grab the trash? Just I wanna bring it out. If I'm here, I might as well clean things a little bit up. Look up. People never look up. So it's time for you to look up. He is waiting for you? Question mark? What if I will hold my cross when he gets in? He's going in. Yes, our demon! Uh, no, it's not the cross. That mouse is going over there. No, I will find the mouse. I will hit the mouse. I will hit the mouse. If I cannot escape, you cannot escape either. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, I found the paper. 
three five one three five one and what's the last digit i can guess it would take me 10 guesses three five one six one nine yes that was it i wanna have that key and i uh, wanna get out of here big book back and there's my key ho ho i did it i did it ha, ha, ha. i logged out the monster but willy nilly is here the evil mad cartoonist scientist flashlight okay okay give me that flashlight first why can i have it Okay, okay, and now scurry. Close the door. Close the door. Oh my goodness! Why can I grab that flashlight? Finally! So the last time it didn't let me do that. We have to be careful what we push and what not. It can decide between life and death. Rupee. Eventually, I presume we'll need to push one of the buttons and get out of uh, through the vent system. How about open the closet with our cross in our hand? Nope. Something just came to my mind. What if we somehow have to bring back the electricity? There's a button to push and there's a button to push. Something tells me we need to bring back the electricity. But how? Okie dokie, can you help me? Listen to me, listen to me carefully. If yes. You open the hatch and get out of here right now. To do that, solve the puzzle of the box. Solve the puzzle of the box. There are quite a few boxes around. That's a box. Um, that's a box. Um, okay, there are two boxes. Did he mention and talk about this box or this box? Help me? Are you just really a little fella who needs help? What if I show him the cross? My one- <laughs> What the hell? Why was I eaten? I showed him my cross and he felt like jumping on me. What happened? <laughs> Why? God fucking damn it, dude. He likes my cross. He doesn't necessarily like my lamp. My flashlight. You cannot get too close to him, though. He will eat you. He will eat you alive. It just dawned on me what we have to do. There's this paper. I thought about pushing the buttons in the order of the colors, what we can see in the picture. So the monster will attack us. Green, yellow, blue, red. Green, yellow, blue, red. Okay, I solved it. I solved it. I solved it. Yes. Whew. You're good, but be careful. Awesome. He hears you and sees every move you make. Most importantly, don't think about looking for me and rescuing me. <laughs> I'm already. Don't worry about it, Paul. I've never seen you in my life. You seem like a nice dude. Give him nice advices. You know what? I actually I want to save him. I don't want to be cruel. He was so nice to me. Um. So he sees you. I know he sees me. I swear this is like an escape room. Oh, the cross. We got use of our cross finally. So we can go on, do you think? Okay, thank you. I just died. Ah, but I don't have to start it all over. That's awesome. That's awesome. Because whenever I died in the last room, I always needed to start it all over and it, it started driving me crazy to be honest let me watch my cassette 
You will never catch me. Can I? Okay, <laughs> he's not. He's not here actually. <laughs> oh, ah, oh. that was a heated moment. With my cross, I know that I can go on. That's awesome. But I doubt we don't need to find anything else here. You know, this game has been a slimy ass bitch to me. So I don't think it's not hiding something. It's, it must be hiding something. Never mind. I just gave up. <laughs> I go on. Moving next to our parkour session. It's not, not an easy task, you know. Am I being chased here? Just want to know. Do I have to like hurry or not? Am I good? Okay. I'm good. Oh, on the tongue, oh, on the circle, big jump, ah, big jump coming up, oh, oh, I knew it, okay, no, no, no time to f*** around, f***, wow, that was creepy, the next door, however, is just a simple parkour session, you don't have to use your brain, just have, you have to use your uh, muscle brain, I can do it. I can do it. Yes. Perfect. 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 Oh, yes. And crawl. Please let me in. No. Oh, God damn it. I exactly knew what to do and I couldn't do it. There was such a good run there. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just hide in there. No. I can't! Oh, fuck! Do I even have to hide there? Or is it something else that I should do? I'm not even sure anymore. Seems so easy. The hard part in it is you have to crouch while approaching the um, closet. <laughs> oh, no! Who oh, that? Okay. Okay, so it was just a trap. <laughs> Making you think you have to hide or need to hide whatsoever. You just plate yourself to your monster willy-nilly. Um, did he die? By the way, there's a cassette. There's another cross. Why is there another cross? Pull that again? We have to, <laughs> we have to get back to in one piece. <sighs> well, well. Now that I have, <sighs> in the time of the world, I cannot do it, of course. But now, I'm only gonna use my instinct. I'm not even gonna use my eyes. My eyes are closed. My eyes are closed. Maybe you see my eyes are wide open, but they are closed. <laughs> you have to believe me. Time of trust. My fucker. Okay. So back. Whoa. Okay. I. I thought I didn't have to jump. Look at our ways, and where our ways got us, right? Look at me. I'm going home, and he's in the abyss. Was it worth it? Wait, it feels stinky. Ah, really stinky. Woo! Okay. Oh my god, the way back is so much harder. Okay, just go there and jump. Jump. Okay, one more, one more. You can easily fall between those gaps. <sighs> Yes, I did it. Okay, I did it. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's so awesome. <laughs> it's so awesome. I'm so happy. <laughs> There's a door with a lot of question marks. I wonder if our Paul is in there. Because that's the exit. But I want to save him. I want to save him. He was so nice to me. Um, our cassette. I will watch my cassette. Oh, it's burning now. My cross is burning. 
<laughs> what the hell? Is it like blessed? Can I actually protect myself with my cross? And now that maybe. Yes. And bring out the cross. No. <laughs> Take the key. Turn on the walkie-talkie. Find a way out. Oh wait, it actually told me that the exit is the one that have the question marks on it. What? I have a burning cross, dude. If I were you, if I were you, I wouldn't be fucking with me. I have a key. And that told me that the exit is actually the question mark. The door with the question mark. That seemed secret enough to make me believe, you know? I'm um, uh, out with my cross. Out with my cross. I had my cross out. And that was it. That was it. I didn't have a I didn't even have a chance to save uh, Anthony who was talking to me through the microphone. The walkie-talkie, I'm sorry. I think this game had some subtle scares which I definitely couldn't have predicted coming. For example, opening the closet at the end of the parkouring session, which you, you would have thought that you would have to open the closet door. You have to crouch in and wait for the monster to leave. But no, there was a, a lever that you had to pull. It was so awesome when the expectation meets the reality. That closet wasn't there to save your life, just to trick you over. What I didn't like about the game, that in the first two sections, if you died, you had to start it all over. That was just a chore. Why can I just jump right over to the next room if, I, if I've done the first one and if I die in the second room, right? But otherwise, I think it was an excellent little game. It'll have a continuation so i'll be waiting for it i enjoyed the game i hope you enjoyed it too and see you next time bye